recent years, I would say that uh, uh, Europe has been uh, emphasized as an economical uh, union, uh, but there certainly is something more than only economy and wealth and wealth creation. Uh, just want, wanted to hear your thoughts about uh, what you said last night and, uh, and why is, is it important to know your history? Well, I think we should remember when people talk about the economy that you know, the generation of a, a good economy is not an end in itself. Mm -hmm. Because what do you want the wealth for? You want the wealth to achieve other aims which are generally social and cultural. And how do we define our social and cultural aims? They are shaped by our past, by our identities, by the things that have made us the kind of people that we are. So I think for that reason, if we forget the past, we're condemned to keep repeating it. Mm -hmm. So for that, again, I would say that we need to give people an opportunity not to have an unquestioning look at the past, but rather to have the skills and capacity as citizens of Europe today to look back and say, yes, that's where we went wrong, or perhaps maybe we should look at this again. There was something in it, maybe not everything, but there was something there. And that perhaps also we should think that sometimes a great deal of what we are is shaped by the spirit of those who went before us.